So this is video two in the Baronet Super 130s, a tie-in mill collection from Retta. There's lots to show in this book, but I'm going to focus on two particular article ranges. Uh, so the first one here, I want to show you our hairlines. And so the hairlines, they do three that are just really dynamic. You have a charcoal gray, and I'll focus on the style number first. So you can see them, and then my favorite is definitely the mid middle blue here. It's like an electric blue, uh, and I'll show you why here in a second. And then the third is the deeper navy blue with a royal blue decoration color. I'm going to go back to the middle swatch just because I mentioned it's my favorite. Um, the thing with a hairline stripe, whether it be this one or the other two colors, is they really are great picks for people that don't have like a super healthy rotation of suits. And the reason being is the stripe itself is not real amped up. It's very subtle. So you would see it like across a conference room table, for example, but not necessarily, ne necessarily excuse me, if you're walking in from the door itself. And so that's really nice in a stripe because whenever you wear it uh, more frequently, people aren't going to go, oh, there's the suit again, for example, you know? And so that's what's nice about the hairline um, stripes themselves. Uh, but I want to show you a, a lining in particular because one of the things I like to do is pull out a color range of the um, decoration color in the stripe with the lining itself. And so this is a jacquard. And so jacquard itself has both of those colors that you see in the stripe and this plus the other custom I details or details that I do on your suit as well really do make it spectacular. But this is uh, definitely one of my favorites in the red range. And then the other article range I'm going to show you is the shark skins. And so the shark skins basically are a textured solid range and they're phenomenal for replacing any of your solid suits. The first one you see here is that salt and pepper kind of light gray, which makes it really nice for uh, the April, I would say, through September months uh, because of color, not because of weight. Uh, now, the thing with the light gray shark skin, I'll show you the other colors in a second. One of the things you can do is a monochromatic look, like for example, a black shirt underneath a suit and wear it open collar. Here you see just a really subtle uh, blue, like as a shirt, and this makes up really nice is kind of a change of pace, you know, instead of wearing a white shirt and tie or uh, light blue shirt or what have you with a salt and pepper suit, uh, you could do um, you know, like a darker navy or even a black. And I'll, I'll show you one of my favorite pictures on my iPad here uh, is George Clooney wearing a gray salt and pepper shark skin suit. Of course, he's rocking the salt and pepper hair as well, but here you see it with just a black shirt and black shoes, which is phenomenal. And that's from the Nespresso commercial. I didn't make that suit form i just like that because it represents kind of my idea that i was trying to show you here but in the shark skins themselves as you'll see the ranges that's the light gray uh here you see charcoal gray which is just like one of your most awesome basic grays here uh then you see the deeper uh charcoal as well and then all the way to your uh, kind of interesting mid blue i would say true blue and then uh that starts another series. But that is the Shark Skin series from uh, Fame to Tide Mill, Retta.